Did I hear right? Is the ship at MCON Alpha? That's right. Complete radio silence while we're within one parsec of the Klingon colony on Rhinex 3. But Commodore Winter needs to send his daily operating orders to the ten star bases that are in his chain of command. We can't transmit anything. None, eh? Why don't we compromise? I need to make ten transmissions, and you say we make none. Why don't we meet in the middle and let the Commodore send five messages out? I don't know. That seems to break MCON. Our positions are at extremes, so splitting the difference will give the best solution. Well, I guess so. Excuse me, crewman, I couldn't help overhearing. Yes, sir? The argument you are employing, Mr. Walking Bear, is not logical. In fact, it exhibits the fallacy of argumentum ad temperantium, or argument to moderation, also known as the false compromise. The argument seems to make sense. That may seem so, Tenant, but the form of the argument is invalid. The argument to moderation, or middle ground, is an informal fallacy which asserts that the truth must be found as a compromise between two opposite positions. Individuals making a false compromise are fallaciously asserting that the positions being considered represent extremes of a continuum of options, whereas sometimes there is only a binary choice possible. This argument is incorrect as there are many situations where the middle ground does not achieve an acceptable outcome, such as in the case you were contemplating, that of sending any messages while in total emission control. Thank you, Mr. Spock. Of course. I should rethink what I'm trying to say. That would be best. Even if an argument seems to make sense, it cannot be valid unless the form is valid, and that it does not exhibit one of the logical fallacies such as the argument to moderation or the false compromise. It's only logical. <laughs>